Um, I have a question about the NATO summit. Sure. Um, there has been a lot of um, discussion about Ukraine, but also the southern flank of NATO, countries like Italy and Spain, they want the summit to approve a new strategy to improve relations with countries in North Africa, the Middle East, and work together in challenges like migration or instability. So does the U.S. support this, and is the president trying to, or planning to meet with any leaders uh, of the southern flank? So look, I think we announced uh, some of the bilateral. Uh, we announced the one with the U.K. Uh, Prime Minister. I just announced with President Zelensky. Uh, we will do our best. You know, the president is hosting uh, the 75th NATO summit, so he's going to be pretty busy engaging uh, with global leaders and obviously hosting the event. So if we have anything more to share, I know my colleagues at the National Security Council will do our best to share that with you. Uh, I'm not going to, we're going to have some deliverables, we're going to have uh, some, uh, you know, some uh, statements to make, declarations. I'm not going to get ahead of any of that. Uh, so I'm just going to let this, let this summit begin uh, and let the president actually lead, lead, lead these in the next couple of days. Does uh, the president support this strategy? Has I, 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 I'm, 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 I'm saying to you, I'm not just, I'm not going to get ahead of the summit. We're going to have many conversations, uh, many, many meetings here. I just want to be super mindful. You also asked me about any other uh, bilateral engagements. We have, we've already announced two, uh, and um, and so just don't want to get ahead of anything else. I, you know, things happen when the president is there. He gets pulled to the side. We do pull asides. We try to share them in real time as quickly as possible. I just don't have anything to share outside of that. Okay. Um, sticking with NATO, are there any details you can share on President Biden's meeting with President Zelensky? Just any you know details on potentially what they might discuss? If Biden had um, said he would announce new air defense for Ukraine, will that come up at all? We will definitely, uh, there will be more air defense uh, that we will be announcing. Don't want to get ahead of the president. Uh, look, you saw, as I announced at the top, you saw the president do a bilat with uh, President Zelensky in France and also at the G7. It is always obviously part of those uh, conversations is to continue to show our unwavering support for Ukraine. The president has led in this effort globally, right? If you think about NATO and how the strength of NATO and how uh, it, has, uh, it has grown plus two. Uh, and how we have been able to have a stronger alliance than we've ever had before. That's because of this president. And backing, obviously, behind uh, Ukraine, that's because of this president. So uh, our support continues to be unwavering, uh, and uh, we will have more to read out uh, from that from that pilot.